Hello guys, welcome back to Appendix Stress Club. Today we are going to discuss about Android penetration testing. So here we would like to do a new challenge of capture the flag of CDF. So this time we are putting our hands on Android penetration testing, which was made by Penetration Test Pentester Club. So what are the basic penetration testing methodologies are involved in this? So the basic penetration testing methodologies are involved in this port scanning and attacking port and connection to the device using ADB, shell grabbing and privilege escalations and configure the flag. So just directly come back to the root terminal. Just type sudo su and enter the password. So first we would like to discover the net discover. So here we found our system. I already hosted this system. So I just quit now. You just type nmap minus t4 minus a 192.168.1.87. So let's wait for the nmap result. So nmap will take a lengthy of process time through an android. So let's wait for this. So it's take a lengthy time. So first of all, you would like to look very carefully here. Okay. So here is Android open port is free CU. Open port is double five double five eight zero eight zero. And here is not yet mentioned anything else to study go in depth properly. So first we would like to look PHP client server with eight zero eight zero. Just open the Firefox. Now you just type 192.168.1.87 8080 So here it was mentioned good hackers means we drop here a backdoor for access if you are if you are smart then find the backdoor access and save your machine like a post things only so we would like to find So anyone would establish that there is some kind of verbal tampering involved using the post method. So we tried but did not find anything useful. After we are trying like PHP client on drop, drop beer remote code execution. So we would like to look uh, that is available with the drop beer remote code execution. So you just type such exploit. drop 
drop beer so drop beer have but it's like SS, SSH and SSHT and open SSH so here we would like to look there is no open SSH and everything but no worries we would like to look Android debugging is an a what is will command line tool that lets you communicate with a device the ADB command facilitates a variety of device actions such as installing and debugging apps and it provides an access to an unique shell that you can use to run a variety of commands and device it is a client server program that includes a three components like a client a daemon a server so what is a client can do which sends a commands to the client run and development machine so you can invoke a client from a command line terminal by issuing a adb command so a daemon a daemon which runs a command on a device that the daemon runs on a background process on each device and server which manages communications between the client and daemon and the servers run as a background process and you development the machine so when we are starting the adb the client first checks whether there is an adb server process is already running if it's not there we start the server processing so basically we would like to go for now you type msf console we would like to go with directly with msf console So let's uh, let's start the MSF console. Yeah, now it's game MSF console. So we would like to start ADB server using through a Metasploit. So you just type use exploit android adb adb server exec so now it's k so first of all we would like to look uh, type show options so we would like to set the our host so you just type set our host our host our host 192 dot so you need to mention this in your uh, uh, android debugging machine like android machine okay so is it uh, what is this yes 87 so i don't want this now so 87 so then you just need to input l host so you need to find your machine uh, so you just type i config you find 84 set l host 192.168.1.84 and you just uh, change the port also set L port double three double three and you just type exploit so it was successfully exploited you can see a starting reverse TCP handler 87 connection to a device and Android so it's okay no problem so now what you need to do it's quite and so if you not yet install the uh, ADB in your system, so you just type sudo apt-get install ADB and give your permission password. So you are successfully installed the ADB. So now, once you status, uh, we would like to do now ADB connect. ADB connect. 
double five double five because you need to look here as a port is double five double five so it was connected daemon not running a server of tcp5037 daemon started successfully no worries so you just type adb shell so you got it adb shell directly so you have exploited the uh, android directly so you just type cd okay and su yeah you got it you got it the root shell directly here now what you you need to do so you just type list so you need to find a data so you just type cd data you come in the data so you just type again list from data you just need to look a root so you just go to cd a root and you just type list you got it the flag.txt you just type cat flag.txt so you can see here android you got the root buddy so you have successfully done the privilege escalation on the android machine so that's it guys the android penetration testing write your own guys thank you guys for watching have a great day